Uh, welcome to Mum's Problems, video number five. Today we are going to talk about bed wetting, um, getting out nappies, potty training, and all that malarkey. We've all got different age children, so we're all kind of on different um, stages. Yeah. yeah. Um, so I suppose for, for me, I never did the potty thing at no, all. I, I never, I didn't want the potty. I did not want to clean the potty. I didn't want it in my house. I know you do the potty, and, but I didn't want it there anywhere. So I literally said, if you need the toilet, when I was training faith, you go to the toilet. And I had like a kid's seat thing, like a Peppa Pig thing, and she got to sit up and then it, it roared. Arr, the dinosaur! <laughs> <laughs> when she did like a wee or a poo, and it was like clapped her. And, uh, and that was it. Oh, and then I gave her chocolate. So I've just trained Jude. He and he's what, knew. just turned two? He's just turned two. So he knew, even before he was doing a poo, he was saying to me, Mummy, poo poo, and he'd lie down and lift his legs up. So wow. I thought, do you know what? Yeah, this he's is telling you he's ready. Yeah, this yeah. is time to like take the nappy away. Like He's telling me. Getting back to like the bad behaviour things and how we deal with it, I literally have to wrestle him, and I feel like I'm hurting him because he wouldn't, he will do everything in his power to get away from changing his nappy, even even if Pooh is burning his bum <laughs> and it's red raw yeah, yeah, with yeah. like you know in the bin, and yeah. you know you have to get like pseudocrem afterwards. He will. He doesn't care. He just doesn't want it changed. No. How do I deal with that? Nappy changing. Distract him. Yeah, Distract him. Give him so it's a yeah, poo. When you know, always, whether yeah. it's a phone or a toy or a book. Yeah. With Le Lexi's rolling over so when I when I'm trying to change her nappy she just wants to roll over and get everything so I now have to give her the wet wipes yeah to play and with the top of the yeah. wet wipes so that makes a noise and while she's distracted I have to quickly rip it off and yeah. change yeah. it but you learn to become really quick at changing nappies when they start moving yeah I suppose and also but, there's no point also potty training or toilet training unless until they're, until they're, ready. they're ready otherwise yeah. it's it going to be like Months and months and months, and, and like, then they I get stressed. Say. You get, get stressed, stressed yeah. and then it becomes and an you issue. regress. Yeah. I don't know. I disagree. I think when Kyla Rose was two, I was like, "You are going to get potty trained now. We're going to stay at home for a week. We're not leaving, and <laughs> we are not leaving the house until you've got your knickers on." Oh, yeah. And we trained her. Wow. Bribed her with chocolate buttons, but she was ready. Because if she yeah. wasn't yeah. ready, she, she wouldn't, wouldn't have done, done it. it. Yeah. Faith is still in nighttime nappies. I think she's the only one here, right? No, but that that it, is yeah, is my my out. Thing. Yeah, she's out. Okay. But I remember um, the eldest one being. I always felt like maybe this is too late. Like maybe we should. But I did a but lot some of research. Children with up to seven. Some, yeah, still some children right. they don't have like the normal yeah. response. Yeah, because I tried that three D thing where. Three days change the habit because yeah. that's what everyone tells you to do. That's, that's and the I did time. three and four days. Oh, sorry, it's an it's the day time. No, well, they don't the tell you it's the different. day. The night time's different because it's a subconscious because they're right. asleep, so they don't. Actually but also know the night time, you have to do stop their liquid at five o'clock. Well, I did yeah, all the yeah, rules. Yeah. I did all the rules. I did the stop the liquid thing, and I did a like toilet, Lifter. toilet again, and toilet again. Um, and yeah, and, and, and I walked her in the middle of the night, yeah. and, and then she was really grumpy, and then she was tired in the morning. And four nights out of four nights, the bed was wet, and it just it stressed her, stressed us, yeah, stressed my, my, my drying machine. And uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I just yeah. gave up. So she's still in that. She'll do it because most children, her age, as they get older, then become kind of embarrassed about the fact that That's they do wear yeah. nothing. So right. they then turn around and say they don't want to wear it. Lacey, when I trained her at night, both the girls were dry in the day when they were about 21 months. That yeah. they were ready. They told me, mum yeah. the toilet, and 100%. that was that. Night time was about a year later, mm. and Lacey had about 10 nights of dry nappies. So I thought, fantastic, we'll yeah, do it. Ready. Take it off. Took it off. Oh no, did I take it off? And then you know, after 10 nights of dry, I was about to take it off, and then she like had another three nights of wet. Yeah. I sort of this, but I took it off anyway. Yeah. And she was ready. And of course, you have the odd accident, but she was ready. Yeah. Yeah. I think they need it easier. And they need to have the accident to realise like, that they don't that like that. It thing. doesn't feel comfortable. Yeah, exactly. But going back to potty training, one of the biggest things with potty training is that they won't poo on the potty or the toilet. And everybody comes to me saying, 
What do I do? What do I do with my child? We'll only will withhold all day yeah. until I put the nappy on, and then we'll poo in the nappy. Mine has wow. the nappy. Wow, that's fine. Yeah, the opposite. And with mine, he pooed on the nappy, uh, pooed on the potty before. The, and the girls, yeah. yeah. So but you know what? Like, oh, we did distraction with that. If they yeah. they needed a toilet, and I'd either blow bubbles or I'd say, "Here's a book." So yeah, they felt sure comfortable, yeah. Yeah. and that was the first thing they did. I didn't even did. need to do any of that with any of mine. Like I've been really lucky. Like they, yeah. have, they almost told me, to go to like, yeah, I need makes to go it easier potty. though. Yeah. Every yeah. child yeah, is is it's different, different. Yeah. 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 and that's the thing. Like it really is. Like and it, there's yeah. no time frame. Like one of my friends has had had her little girl potty trained, and she's two in October. She's been potty trained since July, I think it was. Well, and like that's way yeah, like that's yeah. really really early, yeah. but she's been potty trained. But yeah, it's the, just when it's yeah. when they're like in, in ages and like the complete be, yeah. opposite. The biggest thing with potty training really. is to make sure that you don't get stressed. Yeah, that's the thing. Yeah. Like, yeah. If you stress know. or you make a big issue out of it, yeah. they think it's a big issue. So if you're calm about it, yeah, then yeah. it will just happen. If if yeah. Jude has had a couple of accidents, but you know what? I've not been like, just oh my god, that's there. naughty behaviour. That's yeah. not like, oh well, never mind. Yeah. Like, and sort of he's been it. like, yeah, so you're wrong. Like, yeah. oh, you must, you must be on the potty. And do you know what I've found that's been really, really helpful is if you put something in the potty, i.e., he <laughs> likes a leaf. No, he likes a leaf in the potty. I'm like, the leaf is thirsty. Like. Oh my god! I swear to God, That's like so it really works. Like, when he's older <laughs> and he watches the video, he's gonna I kill you. And he's the best way. And he's like, oh okay. And he stands up because, he, like, he needs to stand up when he wees. He stands up already. Like he's too oh my god! Up, right, listen. Stand up. On that thirsty <laughs> leaf note, ping pong ball scenario, um, we'll call this video a day. Um, I've, I've actually felt like I've learned something yeah. in this video. Um, yeah, please like, subscribe and all that malarkey. And we've got one more week to go with mum's problems or parents' problems. And um, next week we're going to discuss social embarrassment. And what we do in social situations when it kicks off, like royally, whether you're on the airplane <laughs> or in a car or in a bus or in the supermarket, we've all been there. What do you do? Um, tune in next week. See you later. Bye.